Hello everybody and welcome back to Dragon Warrior 3! I am Rufo, playing this game for you! Woo! Oh sir! Yay! We've missed a... We've missed a pseudo phase with, with this new town. Which we could have got... Which I could have gotten if I simply walked out of... Out of town and then back in. But it was the phase where useless here was actually constructing the shop. Yay! Oh, yeah, well, let's see what you guys got in stock. Not a lot. Best of luck to you. But as I'm sure you can notice, uh, there was quite a lot of level gain. It kind of happens when you need when you need to grind up over thirty thousand gold. But uh, uh, our crew are kitted out: zombie slashers, magic armor, iron mask for. Nicodemus and Rufal, and Fidget, well, we picked up a bronze shield for her, her because she can use it now. Her iron helmet came from Nicodemus. Rufal's iron helmet I threw into the bank in case I need it, because the iron helmet is the best helmet in the game for sages and pilgrims. Cain hasn't gotten anything new, sadly. He, the sacred robe is very much clerical in, in nature, so, uh... The heathen wither wizard over here can't equip it. Oh, whatever. Also, Rufal's earned Firebrand, and not much else. Kane has has picked up Snowblast, which is like Fire Firebane, only Ice Elemented, and does more base and does higher base damage. Believe it or not. Boom, which is a good upgrade from Bang, which does even more damage than Snowblast will, supposing it affects the enemies. Bounce for bouncing magical spells back at, at the caster. And by kill the most powerful old damage spell of the game. By kill increases the attack power of of the of a physical attack person substantially. Back to the point that I think if they if they're under the effects of bike kill and they get a critical hit, they do less damage. <laughs> it's amazing. He also got day night, which replace, which completely replaces the the use of the lamp of darkness, which I didn't explain before. The lamp of darkness makes it nighttime. Day night gives me full reign over over the time of day. Fidget gained a lot of things, but not as much magic points as I would like. But oh well. She has a lot of mage spells which we are familiar with thanks to Nick thanks to Kane. And a whole bunch of pilgrim spells which we are not familiar with. But all of them are pretty self-explanatory. Sap and defense lower the defense of the defense of enemies. And well, awake is good for waking people up. But heal more is probably the most important spell on her list, making her easily the best healer of the group. Well, let's get back on track, or get mauled by something. Out of the way, punks. Yeah, Firebane does around does around 30 to 40 damage. Snowblast does 50 to 60. But they both require, but they both only take six magic points. So Snowblast is all about better, but it's not as effective against most of the enemies out here on the ocean. Out of the way, punks. Yeah, whatever. Go away. Now the old man had had told us to uh, search around the well at, well at the village of Sue. And Sue is inland from is inland from the from uh, the newly founded town. Continentally speaking, uh, we are we are at we are nearby North we are by North America. What am I wanting to get done here? Aha! 
Boom, baby. No. Of course. <laughs> uh. Spell only affects the monsters that you're having other people attacking, I swear. Since this is North America, we are approximately in the Gulf of Mexico and making our way up the Mississippi. Aha! Ooh. Follow the river! There's only one path that makes it there. So the others dead end or have a bridge in the way. And here's the village of Sue. Which there's not a lot to see here during the night. With the exception of this fellow here. Perhaps the only real difference between day and night. My horse is a horse, of course, of course. He doesn't but he doesn't talk. Oh. So your horse is not Mr. Ed. Rats. Now let us pick up the Staff of Thunder! Which was the item which the old man was referring to. Staff of Thunder, when used in battle, will emulate the Firebane spell, and anyone could use it. So I could leave it with Nicodemus, but, well, he hits harder anyway. We'll hand it to Kane so that he has an... so that he has a better option for... for when, uh, enemies aren't... for when, uh... Casting spells is not all that appropriate, and just as poison needles is not not a greater use. Everyone else has a zombie slasher, so they hit pretty hard. Well, let's make it daytime. Aha! That particular effect you only see if you use the spell in towns. And the Lamp of Darkness actually did the same thing. Village of the Sioux. Oh, these are the Sioux Indians. My bad. So are you, Mr. Ed? No. Sorry about that. We not tell lies. Okay, I gotcha, I gotcha. We could have stayed at the inn. It's only five gold pieces ahead. It's not too bad. I do like horses. He, Mr. Ed? Oh, sorry. That is a lot of selection. Hey there, ma'am. So the echoing flute is somewhere. Got it. Oh, it's in a tower somewhere. And the most unique store in the game, as it's the only place where that I know of where you can purchase a cypress stick, poison needles, or clothes. Sadly, Fidget cannot use the poison needle. Only a wizard can. It's also the only place to buy those flashy clothes. Uh, not yet, but there's gonna be. Ah. There will be. Great. Hello, sir. The vase of drought come originally from this village. However, someone who come here many moons ago from across the eastern ocean take base away. Thank you, Mr. Stereotype. You! Are you Mr. Ed? Yay! And he'll tell us about where to use the, the vase of drought in order to pick up the final key. Oh, so the echoing flute will, it will tell me where the orbs are. Dragon Warrior 2, it told me where the crests were at. Cover a nice green lad in the northern seas. A great wizard lives there. Hmm. Good to know. Well, let us go to other places. Kane, take us out. Aha! Hope we want to go to Dama. Not for a fight, though. Oh. Cut, nuts to it. Aha! And having done that, I'm gonna go take a nap.
Hooray for cheap sleep! Don't! Must navigate river! Uh-huh. Yay! Now we can come to the land of Japan! Prepare for terrible music! Preparing for terrible music. Play terrible music! Playing terrible music, sir. Welcome to Japan! No, oh my gosh, yourself! Oh, sir! Yeah, it's an orb. What do you think it is? Possibly. It's good to keep in mind. Hmm. Appears to be the people here are in some form of distress. What's an Oroki? What's an Oroki? It's apparently a monster things that people that people are being offered to. Young maiden specifically, it would seem. Don't offer someone Oh. I see. Uh, must be if you're offering sacrifices. Run, girl! Pots! Is there anything down here? Well, there's one thing down here. Oh, miss. Oh, you're the you're the next offering. should perhaps help these people, but... Not right now, I need to... That gr that music is beginning to grate. <laughs> ah, your mission has failed, sir. Oh, really? Hmm. Well, maybe we can talk to this Tomoko about slaying the Oroki instead. Yes, we do. We all wear body armor. What, do you, what were you expecting? Oh yeah? Hmm. Oh, that sucks. Of course, I suppose it's good for the people's livelihood. Oh, that's good news. I bet. Existing nearby, eating your people. Hello there, Madam Hamoko. I am? But... Right, Mocha doesn't want our help, apparently. Well, maybe we can force it on the people anyway. The locals would be happy, that's for sure. Well, let's get out of here so my ears will be happy. Yay! Now let's travel... to the shrine! In fact, this might look familiar. Yes, in here is the travel door, or which was encountered on... on route to... To, uh, to Denki. In fact, during my grinding, this particular inn was was quite useful. Because, uh, well, the Golden Claw draws a great many enemies, so it's good to have a rest stop along the way. Well, let us sail northward. To a place where I was going to go before, and then somebody died along the way. Aha! That uh, thunderclap wasn't very useful. Like that. Ah, just kill it. Yay! Conti 
continue northward. To this village. Where? We don't want to be here during the night. We could do what we came to do, except uh, except for talk to all the people. Aha! Muar! Most remote village in all the land. This place is cheap, right? Eh, it's okay. Yes, I did. What if I didn't? <laughs> He's, a, he's impressed that we would walk. Which you can reach here from land. Who? What? I don't know the man. Really? Hmm. Crack water pistol here. Little house of healing. What else we got around here? What's all this, then? Oh, ma'am. Oh. Right. Hmm. For being a... such a remote village, you guys have a very impressive market. With a, an equally impressive selection, really. Sure, what you got? Ah, stuff I don't need. Well, the Staff of Judgment is... It's similar to the... To the Staff of Thunder, but the spell it emulates is Infernos. Aha! Oh, this doesn't help me at all. Oh, sir. Who's Papa Gatero? Mr. Geppetto? Now oh, let's go see. Let's go see about interacting with the, with the local children. There, of course, over here. Aha. Uh, hi. Why does everyone keep calling me that? Open the door! Hmm. I'm not Papa Gatero. Hmm. What about you? Oh, hey there. Oh. oh, thank you. Uh, yes, sir, we are. Oh, really? Oh, everything makes sense now. Yeah, I'm his son. No wonder everyone says I look like him. Oh, well. We've gotten the water blaster, which... Well, at first glance, it's absolutely useless. But it does actually have a use. It makes people move. Supposing they can move. Like this fellow here. Aha! And then he moved, and it forces him to move. But uh, people who are stationary, like this lady here, it doesn't work. It doesn't work on. <laughs> Their reaction depends more upon uh, who the character is than anything else. Well, let's go do something dangerous. If you remember in Dragon Warrior 2, there was a world tree. Well, there's one here, too. In fact, it's right over here. mountain. One mountain, there's another mountain, and it's to the north. 
And here's something that's probably going to kill me. Oh boy. Hmm. How am I gonna handle this? Ow. Boom, baby! Swing and a miss. Hmm. Hey, we survived. Let's not take chances. Either way, these mountains, there's four of them, in a convenient cross pattern. The world tree is in the middle, is where they intersect. Where said cross intersects. I think you know what I'm trying to say. Blast you. Put you two on ice. Wow, those old hags are fast. Mounted on screen for reference. Good grief. Ow. Take that. Good thing for heal more. I just want the leaf of the world tree. Why is everything opposing me at this? World Tree works as it did in Dragon Warrior 2. As in, it brings people back to life. Eesh. But for now, let's get out of here. Next time, we'll do something a bit more productive. I think we'll go for that Echoing Flute, but uh, time will tell. We'll see you then. Later. <laughs>